Hi friends, Tag Tuesday. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Kelly. I would like to thank Talia Nerds Out for tagging me in this tag, which is the Tag de France tag. And please, everyone, forgive my pronunciation of these prompts. I can say plié, tendu, dégagé, développé, all ballet terminology. I may not say them well. I might say it a little bit Oklahoma, but there we go. We are going to go for it. Um, this tag was originally created by Genre Books, so I'd like to thank Talia Nerds Out and also Genre Books today. We're going to get right into the prompts. So the first prompt is Le Grand Depart, a memorable preface, introduction, or opening line. Well, you know, I think Charles Dickens just... He does those opening lines just so darn well. So I am going to say one of his books. I'll try not to say one of the more most famous opening line, even though I'm thinking it in my head right now. But um, it's from David Copperfield. And it is to begin my life with the beginning of my life. And I remember reading that. I was like, hmm, okay. <laughs> All right, so next we're going to go to the prompt two, Melot Vert. If I said that wrong, I apologize. A book under 150 pages. Let's go with a French book. Let's go with The Little Prince by Antoine de Saint-Exupéry. If you have not read this beautiful book, you are missing out. It is just lovely. It just melts my heart. My children love it too when I read it to them a couple of years ago, so I really love that book. All right, number three, King of the Mountains, a book that you persevered with and are glad that you did. All right, I'm going to say Les Miserables for this, sticking with the French theme. Um, this was the first translated book I think I tried to tackle in high school, and I was loving it, but it was hard, and it was kind of exhausting to like get through at first, but I love it and I'm so glad that I kept up. Maloit Jean, a book where yellow is prominent. Well, this is not a French theme. I am going to say The Wizard of Oz because of course, The Yellow Brick Road. All right, next, Lantern Rouge. A book you were late to. Um, I'm going to say my buddy read in May with novel idea, which was Elizabeth Gaskell's Wives and Daughters. And um, I love classics. I read a lot of classics, but Gaskell is just someone that I have had not read yet and had wanted to. And I probably read what will be my favorite first. We'll see. I'm reading another one this month, Ruth, with. Um, my friend in search of wonder in. All right. Or category. What's the hardest book that you've read or failed to read? Well, it's funny. I can't remember what answer um, Talia gave this for, but she said this in Laurelian by Tolkien is one of her answers. And I struggled struggled to get through Tolkien. It had been a while since I'd read, you know, um, his works, the, the, um, Lord of the Rings books. And so there's so much, it goes so much further back. There's so much here and it's wonderful, but it's just a lot to process. And it was really hard for me. It was very hard for me to get through. I get through it. I did. So I read this probably, I was on booktube, so I probably, it was within the last two years that I read the similar alien. All right, next. Endurance, your favorite series. Well, I would say in general, my favorite series is Anna Green Gables. I just, it makes me happy every time I read them. I just, there's just something about Ellen Montgomery's writing in general that just, um, speaks to my heart. I just love it. But Anne herself and her optimism and her creativity and just who she is, um, it just, 
It makes me smile. It makes me happy. All right. Champs Alyssis. Alyssis? I don't know. Your favorite Paris novel. I'm going to say Madeline. I mean, that is just such a sweet children's book. And I, I think really, um, it's just been through so many children, you know, so many children of all, of all ages, adults with, that are child, children at heart and actual children have really been able to enjoy that over the years. And last, Le Quip. I don't know if I'm saying any of this right. Tag some others of the booktube team. All right, so I'm going to tag Bethany's bookshelf and Campbell Book Library. No worries if you don't want to do it. Um, I hope everyone is doing well. Don't forget to support the genre books channel that originated this tag and Talia nerves out. Read a lot. Bye-bye.